This video is for folks who are interested in being able to plant out a whole lot of comfrey real quick. Um, earlier today we were finishing up some of the last spring orders where someone had ordered a number of comfrey crowns, which are nice uh, points that are rooted, have new green growing tips. Those are wonderful, they're really nice to plant around your special trees, but the roots uh, Comfrey is exquisite at being able to root incredibly fast in real competition by root fragment. We sell uh, Comfrey rootlets, we're sold out right now but we'll have them again, but the moral of the story is if you have access to Comfrey, you can plant it out really quickly. So if you want to make a long rhizome barrier or have a huge amount of mulch production or fodder or nitrogen uh, production, it, it's very easy to plant on a quick way. Uh, I made a video prior where I talk about it in more detail. I'm going to link here to that video. But the way I plant comfrey when I'm trying to knock out a huge rhizome barrier or just plant it in bulk is by these roots. Now you can take it as small as you want. Sometimes I'll go as small as that if I'm planting it into prepped soil or wood chips or something along that line. But for good utility, where I know I'm planting into competition, a challenging context, I'll prep a bucket of roots and I'll show you how I plant. I go for pieces about roughly that length, three to four inches. So this is what I would sell or other vendors might sell. And orientation with comfrey is not critical. The top can actually point down and it's going to figure itself out. In an ideal world, every piece points up, but I want a rhizome barrier right along the length of this whole stretch so we have a break between our neighbors mowing and a potential gardening space here. I'm going to shush up and actually plant a little bit. Step on the shovel, I'll lean it forward, I'll slip in a piece. My toe goes on and I slip it out. I'm going to show this a few times. Shovel forward, there's the next piece, slip it in, step on it. Next one, this is a little skinny, so I'll put the whole piece in, slip it out. Now you can see this bucket's filled. I didn't take the time in the shop to get every single piece exactly right, so I can crack them in the field. If you wanted to do a thousand in an hour with a crew, you'd want to pre-process them all to the right length before you went out to plant. If you zoom out a little, you can just watch the rhythm of how I would plant this out. And we'll do a follow-up video June or July. Most likely this thing will all be loaded with comfrey. skinny one I'll put two in the same hole. Hedge my bets. One more little pocket and then we'll wrap it up. I break a little handful just so it's a comfortable amount. I leave the slits obvious. So you get the idea. I'll finish up on my own. You don't need to watch it. But I'll work down this whole line every six inches to a foot, another fragment of comfrey. Early in the spring or late in the fall, ideal time to plant. They'll set root 
push-up and with good luck should be able to beat out the sod with no problems.